let's just say I'm never doing this again, okay? <laughs> what is up youtube ain't that how y'all introductions be like <laughs> anywho hi goddess gang welcome back to my channel i am bringing you another freaking video anywho today is going to be a total different type of video coming to my channel i y'all know i don't know about hair i don't do hair i hate doing hair but today i am going to be dyeing my hair back to my icy white out plug in like some pictures or something of like what my hair looked like when it was like that platinum icy white blonde on the side so you can compare this way. but as you can see like i got my hair cut it's been cut now for about two weeks and i want to like go back to my icy white and as you can see like everything has grown black and like my roots are black and it looks patchy and i look like a cheetah so before we get started can you please make sure that you are subscribed that you're subscribed to my channel and that you hit the little bell ding 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 so you can get a notification to your phone to let you know when i've uploaded a video and then comment down below and let me know what you think about the video slide into my dms on instagram or at on twitter at zero god okay y'all i'm sorry i look a little dry i'm in a raggedy daggedy t-shirt and, you know, I'm going to show you the products I got from this one. I got a mixing bowl and a dye brush or whatever. It was only a dollar. And I got this so that, excuse me, okay, I don't know nothing about hair. That is my disclaimer. So, I got a mixing bowl. <laughs> I got a mixing bowl and I got a dye brush so that I can cook my little crack up. And I also, <laughs> I don't even know how to even describe to y'all what I'm using and why I'm using it because I don't know nothing about here. So this video is going to be freaking hilarious. So, <laughs> also, I mean, I'm already bald. What, what's the worst thing that happened to me? Then I got Clairol, Clairol Professional um, Powder Lightener. And this is what it looks like. And these packs are like, I think like 2 or $3 dollars from the beauty supply store. And this is so that my hair can go back to my icy white. But yeah, so this is what I have. And I have two of these. I so. brought some processing caps, shower caps, whatever you want to call it. I just bought a little pack of these just so that I can put it on my head and walk around with it until my hair lightens. Some gloves gotta have gloves so this is what i'm using that i'm going to mix the crap with inside of this bowl and last but not least i got the um color charm wella toner and this is what that looks like and here it is outside of the uh and this one is called Pale Beige Blonde. So this is what it looks like. And yeah, we about to just jump right into this. Let's talk. Let's have a little chit chat since I'm doing this or whatever. How has everybody been as far as like since the weather? But I know like for the past, I know for like the past couple of days, I have been feeling like kind of under the weather and I have wrote a little poll on my um my insta story or whatever and I was just asking people like what do they do when they're feeling like in a funk because I don't know what it was but I just was feeling like real sad like just real down I wasn't inspired I was off for three days from work it was just cloudy outside and 
I noticed that I was just sitting around, like not doing nothing. I was saying that I was gonna record, never recorded, but I can't jump in front of the camera and pretend like I'm okay when I'm not okay. Like that's just, I can't. But anyway, I'm taking my dirty developer. And I'm just gonna pour it in here. But yeah, we still chit chat in a while, so, because I just wanna know, like, am I the only one? that was like feeling a certain type of way. Look at this. Y'all, we real live. Cooking. I was kind of real down. And I was like even like trying to watch this little spiritual series that I normally watch. It's by Michael Todd. I don't know if y'all ever like heard of him. But I was feeling like real down and I tried to watch that. But like if I'm not in a position to receive a message, I'm not going to force it either. You know what I'm saying? Like I can't. I can't do that. I'm not going to force it and make it seem like, oh, I'm getting a word and I'm not really getting a word. Like, I can't do that. So I, I really had to just turn it off and I was like, I'm just going to come back to this another day. I want to show y'all what this looks like. I'm sorry I'm rambling back and forth between like the weather and how I feel with my hair, but I got a whole conversation piece, you know? But this is what she looking like. She mixing. And it's like a good little paste. Do y'all get perms after you bleach your hair? Like, can is that possible? Like, say if you bleach your hair and you waited, like, four weeks or something, and then you wanted to, like, perm it. Is that possible? I don't know. Maybe I need to ask a hairdresser. I meant to tell y'all I do. My towel was not dirty. Just everybody in my house dyed their hair on this, okay? Everybody dyed their hair on this, so. Put that around my neck. I'm about to just go ahead and start painting my hair. Oh my gosh, y'all. This is my first time ever doing it. I'm going to definitely need more bleach. Okay guys, I am back. My hair is completely dyed. Um, <laughs> I feel like I'm so ashamed to even make this mess. I mean, this is what it looks like. It's completely dyed. It's not the icy white, but I guess it'll lift and be whiter the next time around. But let's just say I'm never doing this again. My best friend would typically do this for me, or I would go to the hairdresser. And if y'all only knew the struggle that it took for me to get my hair like this. I mixed the, uh, what was it, like the bleach with the 30 developer, which was fine. And I'm going to insert a clip. Well, not a clip, a video. I mean, a picture. You know what I'm saying. A picture of what it looked like right after that. Then right after that, I mixed the 20 developer with the toner. And around this part of my hair, it turned like red. So I got scared and I ended up, <laughs> I ended up um, washing it out and I washed it with my Design Essentials Avocado Shampoo just to get all of that out of my hair. Then I ended up 
re well, I had to re-bleach it again because I felt like my hair wasn't like bright enough. I'm gonna insert a picture of my hair after the toner because the toner, like, it turned my hair like a, not, it wasn't blonde, but it wasn't brown. It was, I don't know, it looked like a penny, like copper. And I wasn't feeling it because as you can see, I'm brown, so it just, I don't know, it was clashing with my skin tone. I really wasn't feeling it. Shortly after that, <laughs> I bleached it. And once I bleached it, y'all, my hair started like burning. So like once it burned, I was like, okay, I have to wash this stuff out of my hair. And I guess I didn't leave it long enough. So like all of this was like blue and green. Like it had like a tint to it. Like it wasn't completely blue. It was just like it had a tint to it. I did not record any of this because I panicked. I called my best friend I was panicking like, oh my God, my hair is green, my hair is green. What am I gonna do? So she's like, take the purple shampoo and just massage it into your hair and just let it like sit, let it sit. So. I let the purple shampoo just sit in my hair and I'm just massaging my hair, just massaging it. And then this is how it looks. I put my oil on it, I brushed it. And I mean, I'm not mad at how it turned out at all, but at the same time, I'm just never doing this again. Like, this is the end. Like, I can't do this anymore. I'm not a hairdresser, okay? I don't recommend anybody to do this shit. Unless you know something about hair. Anywho, I just want to thank you guys so much for tuning into my channel. Um, <laughs> and I just hope you all have subscribed already if you haven't. And again, I'm Jazz. Please follow me on all social media platforms at Zero Live Goddess. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.